it's Cycling Explorer again. Today I want to show you an interesting experiment you can do with Coke and milk. Okay, the only thing I've done so far is I took the label off the bottle. I haven't done anything else yet. This happens to be room temperature, but it really doesn't matter. And then my milk, obviously I just got this from the grocery store, so it's still uh, set up now. I had to clean this bottle to get the label off, so hopefully it won't explode when I try to open it here. As you probably can hear, there's a little bit of fuzz. And now, that is now open. I'm going to pull it back just a little bit so I can see a little better. And I'm going to open the milk. So now the milk is open. Now, what I suggest you do is you use three teaspoons of milk. Just the first one. Hopefully you can see that going in there. One. Two. And or three. Now I'm not going to do anything else to that except for I'm going to set it up so you guys can watch it because I'm going to do time lapse on this and uh, I'll be back in about 20 seconds but to you guys it'll be nothing. Now to set this experiment up correctly I had one bottle of coke happens to be at room temperature but it really doesn't matter for this. Three teaspoons of milk although you may want to add uh, four or five if you want it to go a little bit faster. Um, you can use, I used uh, vitamin D milk, you can use skim or whatever, again it really doesn't matter. Uh, the length of this taping was an hour and a half long from start to finish and you'll notice a few gaps here and there that's due to either I ran out of memory or my battery died and I had to replace it pretty quick. Uh, no gap was longer than uh, about one minute. the color starting to change. Now about an hour into this video it really starts to bubble as you can see now it just all of a sudden just kicked in and started going. And I don't know about you, but uh, I don't quite understand what's bubbling around in there anymore. Would you drink that?
Hey, it's Cycling Explorer again. Thanks for watching my uh, Coke and Milk video. This is rather amazing. If you haven't tried this, give it a try. Um, you can do it a lot quicker if you add more milk, but you get a different set of residue than what you get with this. So, I don't know about you, but I'm not sure I'd drink a combination of Coke and milk. The issue I have with this, which I don't know if you can see it, I'm gonna put some pictures after this, but um, you put milk in your stomach when you have, say, um, potato soup. Usually that's made with milk, and then you douse it with Coke. This is what happens in your stomach. This is Cycling Explorer, hoping you have a great day. Thanks for watching. Now get out and explore.